There. That's it. That's him. Back in the building. You know how it is. Looking a little... I got the little, you know, two o'clock shadow going, as you can see. So, uh, I'm back doing another video. And I'm going to talk about something in light of all these gay marriage states that said the third, all these so-called religious folks, man, fuck out of y'all ain't religious. I'm going to talk about these gay marriage bills or pass. Let me call them laws if you want. Let me straighten out my shirt. But, uh, two polls are finding that there's more and more, like, there was a poll in USA Today, there's probably a Gallup poll about this, but the poll in USA Today find out that there's more and more Americans that are more and more accepting of gay marriage. Now this is a this is a, a hurrah moment for like society. We have all become one and we all love each other and fuck out of here. The fact of the matter is, if you're a religious person and you're condoning that bullshit, Guess what happens, man? Our society as a whole is going to hell in the handbasket because number one, it's against your religion, and two, you voted for it, and three, you're still condoning the dumb shit. The fact of the matter is, how can a religious person or and clearly a, a, a majority of Americans are religious? Now, when I say religion, I'm not. I'm only talking about the three main religions that we have in America. I'm, not, I'm talking about. Islam, I'm talking about Christianity, I'm talking about Judaism. I'm not talking about Sikhs, I'm not talking about, you know, Wiccans, I'm not talking about people put a little fool on their fucking heads. I don't care about that. I'm talking about the three main religions that compose 90 to 95% of Americans. Now, you other minor religions take offense, but some of these religions are offshoots of the three religions. Now, how can a majority of these people who say they practice it, who love their God, who's afraid of their God, if you're so afraid of your God, why are you going to do something and vote for something that your God is against, that your God burn a village for? It don't make sense to me. And I understand everybody saying, well, it's their, how can you deny somebody their civil rights? To, look, I don't care if you get married. If you want to be a man, marry a man, or a woman that married another woman, go ahead. It's just cool with me. But don't expect me to vote for this bullshit. I don't... It's not that I don't believe it. Like if, if I have certain, believe it or not, I'm a little religious, and that if that goes against my belief, I'm not voting for it. I'm not voting for. I don't vote for people to screw sheep. So why should I vote for people to screw the same of their own? And then they're going to get people saying, "Well, as a black man, you should." I ain't, I ain't got nothing to do with shit. That's a, that's apples and oranges. Uh, the civil uh, look, man, and all you little crybabies were crying about all the gay civil war, this, that, and the third. Fuck out of here! That dude, that what, Barnyard Austin or some old crap, whatever his name was, who was Martin Luther King's manner and wrote his speech and he did this. He, 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 where was he at? At the end of the day, he probably came out in his memoirs in the fucking eighties. When back in the, he didn't come out back in the fucking forties and fifties, did he? All of a sudden, now when he comes out in the eighties and nineties, he's a fucking champion for gay civil rights. Well, fuck out of here! You know how can you people accept this? How can you vote for this? And if, especially if your religion condemns this. You know, nobody should be discriminated against. I truly believe you should be discriminated against. I'm not holding you back from that. I'm not holding you back. If you want to get married, it should be like this. It should be point blank paired be across the board. If you want to do it, just do it. But at the end of the day, don't ask me to... Don't ask me to condone an act which my faith and my higher being condemns. It's like, you know, I know there are a lot of hypocrites out here. Now, my morality, my, it's like a video I have about my moral compass. There are some things which, you know, I can dig into, and there's some things I can't. At the end of the day, people shouldn't have to tolerate deviancy just out of the sake of hurting your fucking feelings. If it's deviant, it, look, look, if you don't think people having sex is sick, it's sick. But I'm not, I'm not going to stop saying it because some dude's screwing a horse and he's got feelings. It's sick. And I feel this is... Not the way to go. I don't think gay marriage is right. That's just me speaking. This is not like everybody else is me speaking. I don't think it's right, but if you do it, it's your business. You know how this is the elections and all these voters approve all this garbage. You know, they just provide a it's it's gonna be a big push for years to come though. So the Supreme Court is already debating this if y'all didn't know. So we'll see what's happening. So I'm out here again. Doses. <laughs> Oh, it's funny because it's true. There. That's it. That's him.